Right now at 430, some people are trying to fight a proposal that would bring hundreds of new homes and other development to part of Lake County. You're putting a slice of a city into the middle of a rural setting. Their biggest concerns about the project and how supporters are responding. Some Lake County residents fear a new development could be impeding on the town of Lady Lake too fast for the town to handle. Good afternoon, I'm Greg Warman. I'm Darlene Jones. A group has been working to stop a developer from presenting a conceptual idea of building a community of hundreds of manufactured homes here on this lane. You can get a good view of it from Drone 9 here behind us today. The homes would go up on nearly 400 acres of land here along Marion County Road in the Weirstill area. Channel 9's Daryl Matthews has been talking to residents out there in the neighborhood about their concerns. And Daryl, they want to keep the town they live in just like it is. I mean, you're right, Darlene. Just think of picking up a, the city and putting it into a rural area like this. They moved away from the city, from the hustle and the bustle and the congested roads. And they feel like this proposal would change all of that. We need our commissioners to understand that this is moving too fast and that these infrastructures need to be put in place before these developments are even considered. The fear of overdevelopment in the town of Lady Lake. We don't have the resources to, available to our own community and the people that already live here, let alone potentially bringing thousands and thousands more. The development would be built within the existing Grand Oaks Equestrian Resort along Marion County Road. One plan for the development called for as many as 800 homes. They plan to keep what's on the property the same with little upgrading while placing the manufactured homes similar to these around the property. The goal isn't to go and create an environment where people do not want to live. And to be able to enjoy the landscape of this property is the reason why we love this property and why we're going to do, um, we're going to maintain this character of this property. Jorlin Johnson says the town's infrastructure isn't ready for the development, also fearing the removal of trees and draining water from the aquifer. We're working together to come up with what is going to be the best plan forward to help um, the community as a whole, not just one you know, specific segment of the community, but the community as a whole. Now, the developers have not put in the application as of yet. That's coming from the town of Lady Lake. And if they plan to get the ball rolling, that would be in January. Then it will be a conceptual workshop with the commissioners as well as planning annexation, followed by two public meetings before a final approval. We're live in Lake County. Daryl Matthews, Channel 9 Eyewitness News. Daryl, thank you.